A Brainerd Lakes area family is still fighting for justice after their daughter and granddaughter were hit by a driver with a suspended license in 2015. Today, Vaughn Gentry appeared in Crowan County Court for his probation violation. Sarah Winkleman was at the hearing and has details. Macy Cuyava and her daughter Sophia were hit head on by driver Vaughn Gentry, who was driving with a suspended license. Macy is in a nursing home here in Brainerd and, you know, has, has a traumatic brain injury, uh, had recently was having seizures, had to get on more medication for that. So this is, you know, a lifelong process for her. The family continues to fight and has been working closely with Representative Josh Heinzman to increase punishment of this offense. Looking at uh, how the penalty is decided, and in these cases where you have an individual who's uh, driving without a driver's license, either due to suspension or revocation, the penalty is, is, in a lot of folks' opinion and in my opinion, very low. It's a misdemeanor. During his one-year supervised probation, Gentry was ordered to complete 240 hours of community service. At the one-year mark, the hours were not complete, and he was given an additional year probation. And it's something, honestly, that absolutely devastates my clients routinely. Not only this county, but other counties. It's what happens. Gentry stated that multiple injuries contributed to him only completing 43 of the ordered 240 hours of community service. Now Von Gentry will serve 30 days in jail starting on October 25th, giving him that time to detox from all of his pain medication. This portion of it is over for us. We would have loved to see seen 60 days. Uh, the judge gave his ruling as to why that wasn't going to happen, so he'll be there for 30 an outcome that the family hopes will change in the future thanks to Macy's bill. We're talking about human life here that has been affected tragically and we have to do something to help people understand that driving without a driver's license is not okay. The family is happy to report granddaughter Sophia has recovered well from her many surgeries and is living as a normal seven-year-old girl. Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. Von Gentry's 30 days in jail could likely turn into only 20 for good behavior. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.